Alright, hi guys. So, um, my name's GG, and today I'm going to be showing you uh, a new brush for the Voxel Sniper plugin on the Voxel Box. And I like to shake my head while I talk too. Alright, so basically, this brush is like insanely complex. Like, you, you can't even comprehend. There's like 12 different variables, I bet, and all this stuff. But basically, you just click and like hold down your click button. You know, some people like to bind, you know, like their left mouse button to like the shift key or something, so you can press a button to do this instead. But you basically just, uh, you just think of something you want, and then the brush makes all of your wishes come true. Like, we're just basically going to make an island, and the entire time we're just going to be like right clicking. Alright, so, uh, my companion, Thimbletack, we supposedly got married on a boat a few days ago, um, we're going to make an island. Alright, so I just set up some variables, so I, I changed it from clear mode to uh, kind of like a island mode, island foundation, and it kind of basically will just do whatever we want it to do. It like automatically will speckle in cobblestone and some limestone and stuff without us even having to like do variables or anything like that. So we're just going to create the foundation. Uh, Thimbletack now wanted some water, so as you can see, the brush just automatically switches to water. All he has to do is just, you know, right click. My bad, I was all telling you left click. It's it's right click. You know, the brush can get tricky sometimes. Like, you know, you're like left click, right click, which click do I do? But, yeah, you know, so right now, you can see over there, he's kind of making a bit of the taller mountains and stuff, while I'm just trying to get the, the basic foundation and shape down of this mountain as we as we make it. So, you know, the build anything brush is, uh, it's very new, it's still in prototype, uh, it can build buildings and stuff, too, it can, uh, build forests, it can, it can build anything you really can imagine, it's really neat, but we're just showing it in, a, a terraforming in this situation. <coughs> <laughs> oh, dear, alright, but, uh, yeah, so, look at this, you know, it's just pretty much amazing. Alright, so now the vegetation part will begin to kick in soon, once I... Uh, get the rest of this, but you can see how it's just automatically popping in whatever I really want it to pop in. You know, maybe a bit of dirt, and some cobblestone, and stuff, and you know, eventually, you can see over there, Thimbletack, uh, he wanted some vegetation, and it's just popping up trees wherever he feels like it, you know? So, this brush basically just reads into your mind, you need like a special, uh, a special arrow, like the one I'm holding, to even make it work. It has to like read your mind and figure out what you want, and then it will just manifest it into this voxel boxian world. All right, so I think sorry, there's a lot of stone we have to make before you know mountains are big and stuff, so you have to put down a ton of stone. But uh, I think we'll get to vegetation. You can see some the vegetation really wants to come out. It's like kind of just now like floating in the air type thing, but uh, I'm sure it'll eventually manif like form or something condense into a tree. Hopefully we can cross our fingers or something. Sing a song. Hurry up and make some... There we go. Alright. See, the brush is sometimes a little unresponsive, but, you know, once you just put your mind into it, it'll just start creating whatever you really want it to. So now I think there should be kind of like a, a steeper part of the stone right here, kind of where it kind of will pop up. I'm gonna put some trees down with the do anything brush, and uh, yeah, Thimble Tack is gonna add in some water because he thinks there should be a waterfall there, and it just predicts that there will be land there to hold the water, so it just puts it there for now. But eventually there'll be land, so yeah, you can see that I'm now creating the the mid plateau. Well, Thimble Tack uh, goes around the edges and creates more water and stuff. As you can see, though, it just predicts exactly what you want it to do. Like, now it's just gonna put some, uh, forest down and whatnot for us. There we go. It's very nice. And, uh, just continue that all the way around. And as you can see, you know, all I'm doing is just holding down the right-click mouse button. You know, I don't even have to, like, type in anything. It's just automatically doing all this for me. Oh my god. Alright, so... Look at this. And now now we're just going to work on the top a bit. See? Like, it predicted there was going to be, like, stone there for the waterfall to flow down. 
That, that's how amazing this brush is. And look at this, it just like pops up rainforest trees wherever it feels like. But yeah, so uh, you know, this plugin is still in like prototype beta alpha edition. It's uh, if you pre-order Guild Wars 2, you get access to this plugin. <laughs> Sorry, uh, shameless advertising there. Okay, so, yeah, look at that. And just a few more clicks, and we should uh, be done. Almost. Just gotta fill in some more trees right around here. Alright, look at that. And then just finish up this, uh, this coast right there. And there we go. Alright, now I'm gonna show it real quick with a building also. Alright, so now we're gonna do a building, basically. And uh, it's pretty simple, but for buildings, you need this magical blue scepter. Alright. And all you have to do again is just like switch the brush to building mode and it'll be like, oh, okay. You can see my companion dimple tack there in the background. Alright, so let's get started, alright, shall we? Alright, so there's like a little mound for like a, a stone mountain or something. There's like a few clicks, so it'll be like, oh, okay. And I'm like thinking, you know, since I'm a wizard, I should just make a wizard tower, you know, so I'll just basically click around and it's all like, ooh, ooh. And then. Oola Woola Doola, it's a wizard tower just manifesting out of nowhere. It's amazing. You should try it out. So, uh, yeah, look at that. You know, it's just like... A few more clicks, and... Voila, there we go, you know? So, if you ever thought, you know, like, building was hard, you know, just shut up and get this brush, okay? Alright, see you later, guys.